hello everybody welcome back again to my channel my name is jessica a mommy vlogger a mommy content creator that is living in Nui, anambra state of nigeria and if this is your first time of coming across my channel you are highly welcome please subscribe to my channel subscribe i am begging also hit the notification bell beside the subscribe button for you to be getting a lot of my videos please go through my videos at least you will see one or two videos that you will love and as well share so in today's video we are going to talk about nigeria and the recent happenings we are experiencing in this country yes so when i made a video about things that you will love as a foreigner coming down here for a short stay or vacation i mentioned about sightseeing and tourism centers where you can come and hang out with your friends and loved ones you understand and i also mentioned about keeping late nights that here in nigeria no security poor security and everything that you cannot be able to stay late outside and if you eventually go out and stay late then you have to find an alternative place and stay over then the next day the next morning you have to return back to where you called your base you understand so someone said oh you don't want to talk about kidnappers hey jesus christ this person dropped this thing as a bomb so you don't talk about kidnappers in nigeria kilo day ah ah let's see come bring this talk now hmm yes we have poor security like i said yes kidnappers are in nigeria i will not deny the fact my dear brother or sister it is not only kidnapping case like we have issues of rituals going on in nigeria like the one we read of recent just two days ago a help strangled her madam's baby like what is actually going on i know there are some evils going on some other parts of the country i know i know definitely but i am talking about the one we are facing in nigeria the thing here is this our leaders they are not even trying at all in as much as um their promises they did not meet up we citizens we are trying everything possible to you know help the situation when you know that a country is moving forward is the way the leaders will address the citizens the way the leaders will come out and address the whole issues you understand but here is a different case they don't care they don't even they don't even care that's just the main thing they don't care so this is more reason we have been trying so hard preaching day in day out for us to come out together and vote for younger generation okay we don't need all those old men there you know they don't reason very well they don't think like the way we think i don't know if you guys are trying to understand me they don't reason the way we are reasoning some of their children are not even in this country they are not they are outside this country you know doing their own things they don't care since that their children are not here then they don't care all those ones that are in nigeria are nothing to them so there is nothing they will address we have huge problems facing us like every blessed day we are seeing one problem and we are tackling one problem nowhere is safe we don't know or we can't predict what is going to happen tomorrow we can't predict what we are going to see tomorrow we are not even going to like know what we tackle tomorrow but we really thank god that we are alive today to witness today so some of you thinking that oh that nigeria is this nigeria is that kidnappers are everywhere see like i said on my previous video that some are still friendly nigerians some of them are still friendly we cannot deny the facts okay even if there are some criminals living here even if there are some hoodlums living here we still have good people that can give you shelter 
give you open arms you know going to welcome you and everything so attacking us with kidnapping case is not enough because i know some countries are facing kidnapping cases yes you can ask around you can check you can google because we live in internet world so anything that you want you just google it and you see the answer so i just want to address this issue please stop calling nigeria kidnapping um country and all that please i am begging that we have bad leaders does not mean that we some nigerians are not good or the entire nigerian citizens are bad please just kindly stop it okay it is not healthy i don't find it funny because i cannot come out and say oh the entire ghana are all kidnappers or the entire south africa they are all kidnappers or you know i will just generalize with such sensitive word i don't think i can be able to do that so please just kindly put an end to it i don't know i think um we africans should do better because we are promoting one africa we are promoting unity we are promoting oneness we are promoting love peace charity um making other people to or rather making other african country to feel less of themselves is something that it is not worthy enough okay so just stop i did not even reply the comment i just like left it there because i don't even know what to tell this particular person i don't even know how to start i feel like to come up here and address it and let us learn on learn and relearn some of us are not born criminals please we are still good there are some people here that are still good okay there are some people still here that can help you in time of your need please just um disregard everything that will make you to think that all nigerians are bad all nigerians are kidnappers all nigerians are filled with evilness in their hearts you can't tell me that there in your country everyone is perfect in fact nobody is perfect no country is perfect acts around they have their own issues they are dealing unless you don't want to listen unless you don't want to check out and know okay you don't tell me that okay apart from nigeria other countries other african countries are good we are passing a very big phase right now which is trying to make our country move okay trying to make our country to coordinate a little bit for her citizens so you don't just target that all of us are kidnappers like the way the person <laughs> oh god please oh if you want to come to nigeria please come come to nigeria if you want to pay a visit to nigeria some youtubers are coming down to nigeria to have fun they did not kidnap anybody they did not kidnap anybody please i mentioned some points if you want to come down to nigeria and have fun come and have fun but you need to follow what i said which is don't keep late nights okay don't go out without telling your host where you are going to don't go out without telling one or two persons where you are going to okay and if you want to keep late nights please stay back the next day you come back okay anything can happen i said it in that video but i don't just like it please and i need to address it because that person dropped the the the, the comment on my video i don't like it it is not healthy we are promoting one africa like i said we can't uh, move forward without helping one another i know some people will still come and tell me no nigeria go your own ghana go your own south africa go your own we are one come break con sunshine we are one so this is what i have to say if you love this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel so we can become one family and also share this video recommend my channel to your friends okay my name is jessica a mommy vlogger a mommy content creator that is living in navy anambra state of nigeria so i come your way next time for now take care and bye bye